Welcome to the Zoom Player Advanced Playlist Control Tutorial. To begin with, we'll open the Advanced Playlist Control Interface by clicking this button here. In this uh, dialog, you can see the entire playlist currently visible. And we have several buttons here on the right, which we will address a bit later. And then uh, you have uh, the type of search criteria. The purpose of this dialogue is to do sophisticated searching and manipulating of the playlist. For example, I can now sh search for all the playlist items that contain the word life. You see, I have three items in the playlist, four items actually, some are identical that contain the word life. And now I can manipulate them. I can move them to the top of the list, as you can see here. And right now I only moved the selected item. But if I select all the items by clicking this button and then click move to top, all items are moved, as you can see. Next, I can remove them for, from the playlist. So, for example, right now I have life support selected. So, I'll remove this item. And as you can see, it disappears from the playlist. Next, I can move items uh, to the bottom. For example, I'll move, I'll do a new search and search for tonight. As you can see, I didn't even have to type in the full word because there's only one entry that starts with Tony. So now I have Alt Tonight selected and I'll move it to the bottom of the list. As you can see, right now it's in at the bottom of the playlist. Other type of searches I can do is uh, just for starting with a word. So if I just start with Tony, right now there is no item. But if I look here, I can see uh, starting with do. So I'll type do and I have found the correct item. Next, I can do more complicated searches like multi-item searches. This is done by entering several words separated by the pipe character. So I'll search for do and I'll search for um, sleep. See, I only had to type S and L and already found the slip away song. And the pipe character, if you're not familiar with it, it's the same character as a backslash character. Like this is this is a backslash character. But if you hold down the shift character while, while typing this character, you will get the pipe character, which appears either as a vertical line or as two vertical stripes, depending on your keyboard. Um, on the type of keyboard layout you have, the type of manufacturer you use. That's it for the advanced playlist control. I hope you found this video informative and visit us again.